Now to create a custom PF restrictors along with the functionality of this channel, again go back to SC41 and here click on copy restrictors. In the from program, we will enter SAP standard program that is SAP LSALV and here click on F4 help and select this standard status and now this is our program in our program what we will do we will create the PF status with same name by adding a Z at the starting so what we are doing here we are creating a PF status for our custom program but with reference to the standard one let us do a copy ok click copy here ok just click copy go to change mode so here we can see see by default all the codes are copied ok menu bar application toolbar function key in function key there is no save button so I will enable save button also here by giving the ID and at the last I will add one icon again here this time I will take some other icon last time we check with the button ok so we will just take icon and select any icon based on our requirement whatever icon we required ok let's say I am just selecting icon underscore ok maybe this is already there so let's search for some other icon which we can use which icon ok let's say icon like open folder ok we can use any icon based on our requirement select the function key and here again like give the text open folder open folder ok save and activate now copy this and again go back to our program last time what I have added here I have added P of 1 so this time we will change this to Z standard save check and activate now if I execute this report this is the magic here see now this time you can see all the standard toolbar and along with that we also have our custom button here custom icon open folder ok so what we can do like here with the option we can use the existing features like filter sort ascending descending sum all these standard features we will able to use without any additional coding ok so all this we will able to use without any additional coding here and up along with that we will also get our custom button here so we can write whatever logic we want based on this custom button if you click this open folder now our user command will get trigger for remaining all our user command will not get trigger but for the custom button custom menu bar it will get trigger so I given the value as icon so see here we can see as icon ok so in this way we can create a custom PF status along with the standard functionality and we can perform our required operation based on this so in this way we done with this session like creating of custom PF status by copy of the standard one thank you